religions. It has the ability to bring people together. You don't even have to understand the language. When you hear the music, you are touched by it. And you know what happens? When we come together in music, when we sing, when we rejoice, when we do so for peace, peace of, for, for, all man, for all mankind, regardless of our religious beliefs, we do one thing. We sanctify God's name. Amen. Daniel Ben Lolo from the Sharit Sedek congregation here in Montreal. Uh, this is a testimonial of uh, how wonderful it is to be together as one. And last night, 350 plus people from all backgrounds, Christians, Jews, uh, got together and s uh, sing God's praises. Um, it was an emotional and electrifying evening. Uh, of song, of words, uh, uh, and of love. Um, we sang for the State of Israel uh, and to tell everyone that Israel is there for everyone uh, that seeks God's compassion and God's love. And uh, we sang Kol HaOlam Kulo Gesher Tsar Me'od that the world is a very narrow bridge and that we all must work together to be able to cross that bridge on a single file and not try to overstep one another. And this is the beautiful message of what happened last night. I really enjoyed the service this evening. That it was such a sense of unity of the Lord, of the Lord's purposes for ourselves in these last days. 
and it was glorious to be here in the festival of Sukkot, to be with all the other nations, and I see so many people who have a heart for the Lord. As Sing Together moves out across Canada in 2019, our goal is to unite Christian and Jewish communities, to not only come together to sing, but ultimately lead in working together for Israel. May God so inspire all Canadian Jews and Christians to each do our respective part for the purpose of pleasing the one Father, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob.